Hello and welcome to our discussion on the cost variances. We'll continue our focus on labor cost variance. We saw that labor cost variance is generally due to the labor rate variance and labor efficiency variance. And labor rate variance is the difference between the standard rate and actual rate and the labor efficiency variance is the difference between standard time and actual time. However, sometime the actual time worked by the employees may be less because of certain abnormal idle times like load shedding or machine breakdown. So in the presence of such abnormal idle time, there will be one more variance called the idle time variance. If there is an idle time, the labor rate variance is calculated by using actual time paid and labor efficiency variance is calculated by using actual time worked. The difference between actual time worked and actual time paid is, uh, is called abnormal idle time. Let us take go back to the example. So we saw that 10 workers working for 10 hours can produce 1000 units of output at 50 rupees per hour is a standard. Actual production is 5000 units. Actual labor is 20 workers worked for 40 hours at the rate of 40 per hour. And there is a load shedding of 2 hours. In that case, the standard time is 500 hours because 100 hours for 1000 so for 5000 units it is 500 now actual time paid is 20 into 40 hours this is the time for which we paid idle time is 20 all these 20 workers remain idle for 2 hours so therefore 40 hours is idle time actual time worked is actual time paid minus idle time is actual time worked standard rate is 50 and actual rate is 40 so let us see the variances so the labor cost variance is equal to standard time into actual standard rate and actual time into actual rate and here you can see actual time paid has been taken actual time paid so 7000 is an unfavorable variance now this labor cost variance is due to the labor rate variance which is the standard rate minus actual rate and actual time paid which is 8000 favorable okay 8000 favorable and efficiency variance efficiency variance is equal to here observe we are not taking actual time paid here we are taking actual time worked here we took actual time paid here we are taking actual time worked so actual time worked is 760 and standard time is 500 so the unfavorable variance is 13,000 now the difference between the actual time paid and actual time worked we call that as the abnormal idle time we call it abnormal because the normal idle time is a part of the is recognized while fixing the standard time itself so any time or any number of hours lost due to any other reasons will be called as abnormal idle time and that is equal to 2000 and by default it is always unfavorable so labor cost variance in the presence of the presence of idle time is equal to labor rate variance labor efficiency variance and the idle time variance thank you very much